Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create a poll in Slack. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest software just under this video. So let's get started. So the first thing that we need to do here is we need to log in into our Slack account. And once you're logged in, we are now ready to add or start creating our poll. Now, before we actually create our poll, we need to install the poll application in Slack. So to do that, we need to go to the left side here, click on the more option and here choose the apps. Now from here, what we need to do is just type in poll here, just press on enter and look for the simple poll option. In this case, go ahead and click on the add button that you see there. And from here, you want to add this into Slack. So in this case, click on the add to Slack button here. And once you've done that, it should initiate the installation process and just click on allow. Now from here, it's going to say simple polls requesting permission to access the software company or the workspace that you have. And from here, you need to check your email for any six digit code that you'll be receiving. Now it's going to look like something like this. So let's just go back into simple poll and enter our code here. It's going to say success. And from here, it's going to initiate or start the process. Now for me, what's the best describe your Slack workspace? So let's just say this is a company and it's like your department. So I'm, doing, I'm going to say IT here. And from here, we want to review the and accept the privacy policy in terms of service. I would suggest you to read through their privacy policy in terms of service, but I'm going to agree to it now. Just click on continue. Continue. It's going to also ask you some information about this one. So maybe I want to say I'm looking for feedback on something specific. What are there is in using simple poll here. Maybe I want to say Q A A and uh, have you used simple poll before? Let's go ahead and answer no and just hit on continue. Now once we've done that, we should be able to see the next page here, which in this case we just need to click on continue with Slack, and this should redirect us back into Slack. Now in this case, you could go ahead and just go back into Slack here and make sure that you actually reload your Slack. But once in here, you could go ahead and go to any channels that you have. And from here, just type in the following, which is going to be forward slash. So let's just enter forward slash here. So just enter forward and poll. And from here, you should be able to see the option that says create poll. So let's go ahead and click on it. And from here, you just need to enter your questions and how how do you want people to respond, your options, your option two, and another question if you want to add them. In this case, you could go ahead and add all the details that you want. And from here, once you've done, you could go ahead and just click on save draft or send me a test poll here. And from then on, you should be able to start creating your poll here on Stack. And that's about it. So hopefully this video was equal to all of you and if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.